Good evening. My name is Nate Klarfeld, and I'm the Broward Steering Committee Chair for the Broward Gala this evening. And welcome to the Our Voices Will Be Heard, We Will Never Give Up 2014 Broward Equality Florida Gala. First, I want to thank PNC Bank as our presenting sponsor tonight. Uh, PNC Bank came forward with $50,000 to get ourselves started this year. Please make sure you get your picture taken over there and say hi to our friends uh, with PNC Bank. They score a perfect score on the HRC Human Rights Council uh, Equality Index, uh, one of many of our sponsors that do that. Uh, also, all around the room, we have our sponsors and our uh, special corporate sponsors and media sponsors all over, and I want you to make sure and take a look at those tonight before you go. This is, this is the meat. This is how we keep going. We do this every year on an incredibly low budget, and it's all because of my steering committee and host committee that work tirelessly year-round to, to make sure that this event comes through at the best. Hi, hi ladies. <laughs> The best thing. I want to thank our media sponsors tonight. Our media sponsors tonight are uh, SFGN and The Mirror, The Florida Agenda, Hot Spots, uh, Genre Latino, and of course, um, Mark's List. As some of you, thank you. Our media sponsors help get the word out and um, give us literally hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of free advertising. I want to make a Short mention, as, as some of you may know, um, we lost a voice uh, in our media world uh, the other night when Mark Haynes was uh, killed in South Florida at, uh, during the Smart Ride uh, walking home from dinner. And uh, we have a special tribute that we're going to give to his family uh, in the back uh, on the other side of the door there if you want to sign that for him. Uh, right now we're working with uh, the other community uh, organizations to figure out a way to memorialize uh, Mark. He was a voice for us. He was tireless in every organization we have ever worked with and uh, has become, uh, it was really, really had become one of our best friends in the media. So um, I really feel that, that this is a, a little moment that I want to take to remember him. Okay. All right, I'm going to acknowledge now our elected officials. Uh, 17 years ago, when Equality Florida started, um, I don't know if many of you remember what it was like to be in, living in the state 17 years ago, but it wasn't very friendly uh, for LGBT people. And for elected officials to come forward and be stand next to us at city, county, state legislators are, are amazing. So I'm going to go through the list of our elected officials. And that is not going to cooperate. And this is Broward County Commissioner Sue Gunsberger. Where are you? She's one of our honorees, has been an amazing, amazing voice for us for 20 years. Is that right? Did I get that number right? 20 something years. Anyway, okay. Broward County School Board member Heather Brinkworth. Broward County School Board member Robin Bartleman. Broward County Sheriff Scott Israel, he's right there. Broward County State Attorney Mike, Michael, Michael Satz. Davey Mayor Judy Paul. Davey Vice Mayor Carolyn Hatton. Fort Lauderdale Commissioner Dean Trantalis. Where's Dean? Where's Dean? Wilton, Command Wilton Manors Commissioner Julie Carson. Wilton Manors Commissioner Tom Green. Wilton Manor Mayor Gary Resnick. <laughs> Wilton Manor Vice Mayor Scott Newton. And Judge Lisa Porter is here tonight. Thank you all.